Hi, nice to see you all again. My name is Future Quarter and I'm a program manager on the Azure Security Center Customer Experience Engineering team. Today, I'm going to help you all get started with the security control restrict unauthorized network access. So let's hop into the Azure portal and get started together. Now, there are definitely a lot of recommendations under this security control, but as we can see here, a lot of them are still in preview. And as we mentioned before, recommendations in preview are not included in the calculation of your secure score. Outside of the ones in preview, we still have a couple that we need to complete in order to get our full four points for this security control. Let's start with this recommendation. All network ports should be restricted on network security groups associated to your virtual machine. As usual, we're taken to our recommendations page. We see that we have the option to exempt, view policy definition, and open a query using Azure Resource Graph. And underneath that, we get some information about our recommendation and some remediation steps. By clicking on an unhealthy virtual machine, I'm taking to the networking blade of the virtual machine. And here I see my inbound port rules. So earlier we learned that with this recommendation, Security Center believes that our inbound port rules are too permissive, which I can see here with any listed as a source and any listed as a destination. So in order for me to successfully remediate this recommendation, I would have to change these inbound port rules. Another recommendation that we have underneath restrict unauthorized network access is IP forwarding on your virtual machine should be disabled. And with this recommendation, Azure Security Center has identified virtual machines that have IP forwarding enabled. And we learn how to disable the IP forwarding in the remediation steps. To implement what we learn here, we can click on our unhealthy resource and it takes us back to this networking page for the virtual machine. And we click on the network interface here. And from there we go to IP configurations. And now we see the option for IP forwarding is set to enabled. And for this recommendation, we want to set it to disabled. So to do that, we would simply just select disabled and as usual, save our changes. And that's it for this demo. I hope you found this video helpful in getting you started with restrict unauthorized network access. As usual, if you have questions, please feel free to leave them down below and I'll see you next time.